welcome to little bunny's workshop today we are going to learn about light we are going to first have some fun facts did you know light is so fast that we could go around the earth 7.5 times per second wow that's seriously fast not even the iss international space station can go that fast around the earth Now let's learn about how we see things. We all know light helps us see things, but how? We are going to learn about that. So first, let's learn about the types of sources of light. There are two types of sources: natural and man-made. What is natural sources? Natural sources are the sources like our sun, the moon, and our stars. Man-made sources are the sources made by the human being, like bulbs, street light, lamps, etc. Let's now go deeper of how we see things with the help of a diagram. So, light comes from the source, bounces off the object, and to the eye. So, this is how we see things. Now, how do we see things with color? You can see behind me many many paintings. You can also see their color. But how? Let's understand that. So let's take the piggy bank for example. It's blue. Why do we see it blue? So the light comes in many colors. So since the piggy bank is blue, it will bounce the blue color but absorb the other colors. So the blue color will bounce off our this. of the piggy bank and right to the our eyes hey little bun buns so our world is full of colors different objects have different colors different furnitures have different colors everything has colors now a apple is red so how do we see it red so the apple absorbs all the colors of light except the red one the red one bounces off the apple to the eyes And a mango is yellow. The mango absorbs again all the colors of light except of the yellow color. So the yellow color would bounce off to the eyes. Now you got it. Good job. A pat on your back. Now there there is a thing called a periscope. Now you'll be thinking, what's a periscope? What in the world is a periscope? Now a periscope is that. The kind of line attached on a submarine. The people in the submarine use it to see above the surface. Do uh, the surface. We can use the periscope for many other things. For example, let's say a wall is much more taller than me, and but I want to see above it, so I can easily use a periscope. So first, the light enters the periscope. There's a mirror right here attached. It it bounces off the mirror, and another mirror is here. So let's say so it comes to this mirror. and then right out to the eyes that's how we can see so here is an image of people using periscopes to see above the head now let me show you one more example of how we see things with the help of a mirror come on follow me come on let's follow me hey can you guess which side am i am i the left or am i the right i'm the left this here Is the original. This is a mirror. In this case, the source is sun, and sun is a natural source. So the light from the sun is bouncing off the object. In this case, me. But and then you can see me. But how can you see me twice? Because it's also coming off the mirror and to your screen or eyes. I hope you understood the concept of light and sources of light. I know I also talked a little about periscope in case you don't understand soon I will upload a video about periscopes thank you to streamport team for filming editing and publishing this video there is a book club called reading culture book club the book club is so amazing you read so many interesting books the teacher that will be with you it's She makes you understand the book so amazingly. I also joined it and felt like the, I was in the story, a person in the story. 
That's how powerful this book club is. You can even get into character. Remember, this is all virtual and online. The links are in the description box below. So if you want to join it, do. And also, we're going to launch the Little Bunny merchandise. The merchandise will include t-shirts and mugs. Thank you. Do make sure to like, subscribe and share this video with your friends. Bye. Bye, 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 bye.